सब्सक्राइब नाउ एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन नेवर मिस एन अपडेट इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन लोकल स्टोरेज एंड सेशन स्टोरेज सो लेट मी क्रिएट वन इंडेक्स डॉट जेस फाइल एंड दिस इंडेक्स डॉट जेस फाइल वी विल इंक्लूड इन आवर इंडेक्स डॉट एच टी एम एल इनसाइड आवर हेड टैग एंड विद द हेल्प ऑफ स्क्रिप्ट टैग एंड लेट मी पास द एस आर सी एंड द पास ऑफ दैट इंडेक्स डॉट जेस फाइल लेट मी क्रिएट वन बटन क्लिक लोकल वन आई क्लिक ऑन दिस बटन इट शुड ट्रिकर अ फंक्शन दैट इज सेट लोकल स्टोरेज सो लेट मी क्रिएट दिस सेट लोकल स्टोरेज बटन और द फंक्शन इन साइड द इंडेक्स डॉट जी एस सो लेट पर्सन इज आर ऑब्जेक्ट एंड इट्स है वैल्यूज नेम एज प्रेस एंड एज हैज ट्वेंटी एट लेट मी राइट लेट्स एड इट इन लोकल स्टोरेज सो लोकल स्टोरेज और सेट आइटम पर्सन दैट इज द नेम ऑफ आर वेरिएबल एंड पर्सन दैट इज दिस ऑब्जेक्ट सो ना इफ यू हैट सब्सक्राइब टू आर चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब नाउ इफ यू आर नो टू द If you are new to this channel, click the bell icon. Let me open it in my browser, and in the inspect mode, as you can see in the application, you will need to go to application and and you can see in local storage there is nothing, and in session storage there is nothing. So when I click on click local, as you can see there is key as person and value as object object. As you can see, it is printing as object object which is not readable. because the local storage stores the value only in the form of string so now in order to store it in readable format let me write json dot string file i am just string file this person object and let's go to the browser now click again as you can see it is now readable instead of object object it is coming as Our object that we have written earlier. So now, in order to get this value, we'll create one variable that is local storage person data equals to local storage dot get item and the key that we have passed that is person. So now, let me console dot log local storage person data. So now, uh, let me write the type of also to check the type of data what we are getting. So we will simply write the type of operator and the variable name. I'll just save the changes and let's go to the browser and the console. As you can see, the type of the data that we are getting is of type string, but we want it to be object as it was earlier. So in order to that. Okay, but we want. Let me create the command. But we want our original option. In order to do that, we'll simply write JSON dot pass and local storage get item person value key. And now the data that we should be getting is in the form of object. As you can see, the type of is object and the value is perfectly an object instead of string. so this is our local storage now let's see what is session storage let me make a comment i'll simply copy paste this button instead of local storage we will write to us session and let me change the name of the function as set session storage now let's go to index.js and create this function Set session storage, and let me simply like copy paste whatever the logic we have written inside for local. Simply uh, change local storage to session storage. Let me remove this command. Session storage, and here also session storage. Oh. Let me simply copy paste it here. Let me change the name to local to session. And again, from local to session. Yes. Now let's save the changes and go to the application. In session storage, there is nothing. When I click on session storage, as you can see, we have person in the string format. 
and we already have it in local and in console you can see the same for the session and local let me add one string here so that we can uh, specify for which console it is coming so session comma so let's save the changes when i click on session as you can see session is coming in front and for local it's nothing just similar that we had earlier now uh, we can see the difference between the session storage and local storage right now as we are done with our coding uh, that basics of this local and session so now we have an application when i close this tab the session storage is having already this string and local is already having this uh, string when i close the tab and let me reopen this in the browser uh, when i inspect you can see that in application our session storage local storage is having the value as it was earlier but station storage has lost the data that we had stored earlier so we, we can say like local storage retains the data even when the tab of the browser is closed okay but whereas session storage lose the data when the tab is closed on the browser now we can also check some more thing like let me simply close this browser let me reopen the browser and let's inspect so even when i have closed this browser as you can see local story is maintaining the data but session storage has already lost that data so we can write the comment for that also for better understanding that local storage stores the data for same even when the browser is closed but session storage lose the data so this is how like the difference between the local storage and session storage in our javascript and this is the most important question as per the interview